Do you understand what your audience value is about your offering? When you hear someone say that something's good value for money, do you know what they mean? Because what a customer is willing to pay depends on what they value about it. A really useful resource in this situation is Bain's Elements of Value. It's a pyramid style setup similar to Maslow's Hierarchy of Needs. That is different for a business to consumer versus a business to business setup. There are 30 elements of value in each, broken into four categories, functional, emotional, life-changing and social impact. And examples include risk reduction or cost reduction, variety, fun and perks, and even hope. So it's a useful thing to use as a checklist to find ways that you maybe already produce value or opportunities to produce value maybe where your competitors don't. So check the links for those resources. Next week, we we'll continue the conversation around value by looking at the relationship between value and what a customer's willing to pay. <laughs>